Hi, are you someone who's interested in selling your home, but you're also very concerned about having strangers walk through it to see it as we go through the sales process during a global pandemic of this COVID-19 that we're dealing with all here? My name is Angela Olmos. I'm a full-time real estate agent in the Northeast Florida area. And in this video, I'm gonna be giving you three easy to follow tips that can help you minimize the physical exposure that your home would have during this time and ultimately get you to the closing table. Stay tuned. Okay, tip number one, the virtual tours. Now, virtual tours have been used for quite some time now, but they're more important now than ever. And these tours have to be very comprehensive as we're trying to sell a home during these times. So what I mean by comprehensive, they do have to include things that were not normally included, such as the garages, which sometimes can be important to some buyers. Make sure that the garages are included in the virtual tours. Also, the backyards, these might also be important to some buyers. So you wanna make sure that you visualize that you're able to digitally show everything that your home has to offer up front. That's the best way to filter out anyone that might not be the perfect fit for the home or the home might not be a perfect fit for and make sure that as you're scheduling physical appointments, these are with qualified buyers that are truly interested and have seen all the details about your home before actually setting up an appointment to come and see it. Tip number two, make sure that you leave all the interior doors open. As you start having physical showings with people that are truly interested in this home, you wanna make sure that as they travel from one room to the next within the home, you minimize anything that they have to touch, such as door handles, a very common place where people would need to put their hands on in order to be able to, to, to come from one room to the next. So you wanna make sure that you leave all of, those, all of the interior doors open. And the reason for that is, is so that they can travel without necessarily having to touch anything in your home while they're previewing it for sale. Now, tip number three is leaving all of your lights on. And the reason for that is so that people don't have to touch the light switches. Now, leaving the lights on has been a tip that's been really useful and it has been around for several years, but it's now more important than ever as we're selling your home during a pandemic. One of the nicer things about that too is that people can visualize what life could be like right open as things are turned on. However, they don't have to turn on the light switches. They don't have to get their hands on those light switches. We wanna make sure that they can travel through your home safely and minimizing anything that they might need to touch in order to visualize what life could be like living in your home. So remember, leave your lights on for every showing. So there you have it. These are just three very easy to follow steps that could help get your home sold safely during the COVID-19 pandemic that we're all dealing with. Now there's a lot more to it. And if you are someone that is actually thinking about getting your home sold but would like to do so safely, I'd love to set up a time for us to connect. We can do that virtually nowadays with all of the different tools that are available for us to meet. We can use Skype, we can use Zoom, we can use FaceTime, you name it. Whatever technology you're comfortable with, we can utilize to make sure that we have a listing presentation where I'm able to go ahead and show you all that would be involved besides the three tips that I obviously have shared with you guys. So until next time, remember to take good care of yourself, be kind to one another, and please share this video with anyone that might be in that situation that I could help get to the closing table.